Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. I hope you guys enjoyed my first unspoken VR video. Um, basically in today's video I'm going to be going over a little bit of training. I'm going to actually be standing up for this entire video so check this out. If my feet start hurting and I just decide to grab a chair, go ahead and hype me up and say no iPod. Stand up. You fat boy. It's time to work out. All right, guys, so ever since the Unspoken VR tournament has been over, I've been very, very busy, man. And this is like the first day that I actually get to dive back into VR. Now, after the tournament, people have been showing me some cheesy moves, man, some cheesy classes. Blackjack class, bruh. Bruh. That class is insane, but I'm still an anarchist. I still need to get up my god darn play. I haven't had any real games played online, but today hopefully I can change that. Hopefully I can go into online and actually do good. So let's go ahead and hop into the video, guys. If you're a competitive player or if you just like playing for fun, if you just like your, you know, poops and giggles, as they would say, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys here. I just won. Um, I'm a novice. You guys can see I'm going up against Agent of Chaos. I'm going to go in for a rematch now. What I'm going to lay out for you guys is what I like to do most, Kamehameha balls. I like to throw a lot of skulls, and I love to throw my lightning rods. Now, with the whole lightning thunderbolt gimmick, what you need to do is you definitely need to put up a shield so that you can go ahead and work on that thunderbolt, or you need to hide behind cover. I'll show you guys all of that in this gameplay. Let's get it. All right. So, Kamehameha ball. There's my target. No, there's my target. You throw one at him. Wait for it to come back. All right. All right. All right. So now I'm going to go ahead and th throw a whole holy skull at this man. All right. Now he threw a little glass protection spell. So I'm going to go ahead and hide behind this block and wait for a couple things to cook up. Now what I can do is I can go ahead and start working on my lightning bolt because I'm not in that much of bad cover. So now I have my lightning shield. He's working on something, so I'm going to go ahead and work on something. All right, he worked on another protection. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come with that lightning rod, and I'm going to beat it right through his guard. Now, everything that comes after this, go ahead over here, see if I have anything. Now, remember, always hold on to a Kamehameha ball because you'll never know when you need it. So let's see, where is he? All right, gotcha. All right. Now, I got two skulls. All right. All right, one skull is following him. I'm going to come over here. And while he's focused on that, yes, we got the win, guys. And I still got a command mail ball just in case. All right, now this is round two. This is where things get tricky. All right, now he's already disappeared over there to throw at him real quick now what I like to do sometimes I like to throw those little fast little shots I'll show you guys in a moment if I could get one co to connect oh no this guy is pretty good on this match all right what I'm gonna do I'm gonna go with skulls here all right now I'm also going to come with a lightning rod because I need to take down his defenses. Ooh, almost threw that. I still got it in my hand, guys. And he's still loading up. So I can throw another one. And I'm going to go for one last lightning rod because I'm an OG like that. All right, now he's popped over there in cover. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over here and get him from back. Huh? Oh, oh no. Oh. All right. All right. I got a fiery skull. I'm going to throw that off. I'm going to come over here. Get a Kamehameha ball and hit him right over the top of his head. Now he's trying to go for that special, but he's right below me, which means he's dazed and confused. Got a Kamehameha ball and a skull, and I vanquished them, guys. You see it. You win. Hey, let's get it. All right, so like I told you guys, my main way to win is to basically put on as much damage before 
they can put that much damage on me. Now, I know when people play competitively, they're playing a whole different type of game. Everything's more synchronized. They, they seem like they know what they're doing so much better than me. But as long as I'm bringing up skulls, as long as I'm bringing up some nice little thunderbolt rods, I'm cool with it, man. I'm, I feel really good about it. I don't know if you guys like it, but I like my strategy. My strategy works. I don't know. I want you guys to spin up in the comment section. Is it a W or a L? And also, if you guys want to see online gameplay from me in this game, go ahead and leave that in the poll above in the comment section below. All right, you guys. I want to thank you guys for watching this video. Make sure you guys check out the Unspoken VR tournament. Um, I have links in the description for all that information for you guys. And a uh, big shout out again to Oculus for the rift and the touches and the everything. Um, but I'm going to see you guys in the next video, man. Peace. Mike Wilmer.